Wow. Just, just. <laughs> My worst nightmare came through in the back of my mind. What I hope would not happen happened. Uh, congratulations to you, Seahawks fans! Y'all came to play. We didn't. Um, shout out. Uh, Seattle Seahawks, uh, 5668, 12th Man Brett, uh, Hawks Next 1977, Dicer Pigpen, all you guys. Congrats on a uh, you know, great performance on you guys. Defense looked great. And, you know, you made your plays on offense, and we just couldn't do shit. So props to you guys on a great win and you know we'll do this again in a couple weeks and I, I just I I I have no words. I, I I really don't have no words. Ugh. Well, as you can see, also, got me a little Thanksgiving dinner, turkey, ham, mac and cheese, collard greens, stuffing, a little sweet potato pie, all that good shit. Great. It's really good. My mom made this. Uh, this will taste better with a Niner victory, which did not happen. <laughs> Richard Sherman. He did his thing, and I can't be mad at him for that. I still think he's an asshole, but as long as you handle your business like he did today, I'm, I, I, I can't knock him. Now, for Colin Kaepernick, y'all know that I've been backing this boy up since day one, and I still will. But you also know me. When you fuck up, I call you out on it. And I'm slowly, I haven't abandoned ship on him, but I'm, I'm slowly losing faith in him. It seems like sometimes when he throws the ball, he's off target. He doesn't have that touch when he throws the ball. His awareness in the pocket doesn't compare to Wilson, and it clearly showed tonight. I mean, Wilson did a great job when shit was breaking down. He made shit happen, whether it be with his legs or finding an open receiver. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. And we we just couldn't make the we just couldn't make the adjustments. We just couldn't. But Kaepernick, what did he throw for like what? 90 fucking yards? Bullshit. I mean, I don't know what more this boy has to do to take it to the next level. But he needs to figure it out fast. And that was a huge loss right there. We had a golden opportunity to control our own destiny, and we probably blew it right there. Uh, 
Unbelievable. Un unfucking believable. I don't know what to tell you. I mean, we it's Thanksgiving, Thursday night, primetime television, and you basically you might as well just put up a fucking goose egg the way y'all play. I don't... This... I have not been disappointed with this team in a few... since 2010. And right now, I'm... At least on the offensive side of the ball, I'm pissed doesn't even describe how I feel. But what can you do? You got five games left. And I'm pretty sure we'll find a way to ground it out with the fucking Raiders of all teams. Wouldn't surprise me. That's how it's been all season. From the playing, the execution, the coaching, Seattle dominated in everything. And props to them for doing that. I mean, I'm more mad at my team losing than them winning. They went out and they earned it. Fucking pathetic. Man, I'm glad I'm off work till Monday. I ain't going to want to go in because I hate when we lose and I got to explain like what happened to the fucking Niners. <laughs> Shit. Ask Jim Harbaugh. Ask fucking Colin Kaepernick. I mean, there's a whole lot. I There's a whole lot I could say right now, but... Maybe another time, or who knows? I'll, maybe I'll just move the fuck on. What choice do I have? He is some of his ham. I mean, really, I I I have no answers. Now, obviously, the Niners' offense don't have any answers. Greg Orman, insert your comment here. Yeah, I. Get some turkey. To come out like that on national TV and just. Throw the game in the shitter like that in your own house. I told you Levi Stadium ain't got no um, real home field advantage, even though I thought the crowd came out pumped up and they were loud, I thought. But what are we, what, three and three there now? Damn, my mom knows how to throw down. <laughs> but I'm getting off subject here. We just look like shit tonight. And no excuses. Again, congrats to the Seahawks 12th man. We'll do it again in a couple weeks, and hopefully we don't lay a fucking egg like we did tonight.
as far as the season goes, I, I'm just going to tell you one game at a time. This has been with, with so many expectations for this team. Not saying we were locked for a Super Bowl, but we were definitely supposed to be in the mix and still are. But from all the off field issues and the injuries, me personally, it's it's taking a serious toll on me. <laughs> and I don't want to say that because of all that shit, I'm just ready to get the season over with. But I don't know how much more of this shit I can take. <laughs> I really don't. But that's why we stay faithful. We fight on. And just hope for a better day. All right. Now I'm done. Yeah, I said what I needed to. So, happy Thanksgiving. See y'all, Swift Man. Not our empire. We fucked up tonight, but. Nothing we can do with just, you know, move on to Oakland. All right. I'll give it to you next time. Later.